Hi everyone, this is Janine Ferranti. I've had quite a few people ask me how I do all my straight lines and my crisp 90 degree angle corners on my windows, um, my house portraits, and what I, with a ruling pen, and so this is what a ruling pen looks like. I hope that focuses for you. And I usually take, it's not black, but it is um, a schminky graphite gray that I've watered down. Um, so it's nice and thin and not too dark. I don't want it to be dark. It's not supposed to be black. It's just supposed to add a shadow underneath uh, my sidings or when I use it on my windows to do my 90 degree angles. I also use a beveled triangle. Is that focusing for you? Let's see. And it has a beveled edge so that when you use it with the ruling pen that it does not bleed under the ruler. You can see that. It doesn't bleed underneath because it has another lip under there. Anyway, I always test it out on scrap paper. This is just scrap paper on top of my painting. And I did it in the other video, which I'll be posting. So I'm not going to do it right now. Um, but the reason why I'm doing this is because the video was taken from this angle and it doesn't give you a real close-up view. So what I wanted to show you is that pretty much the whole upper level of this house has been done with the ruling pen. So all my windows and fine corners, uh, all my siding, the lines from my siding have all been done. And I started to do the lower level on this side. I haven't cleaned up yet with, um, I clean up with a white gouache sometimes if they're really messy and I, I was kind of messy especially on this side. But I hope this shows you, if you look at the upper level where the windows and the siding were already done as opposed to the windows that have not uh, been done with the rolling pen yet, you can see how ragged my edges are, they're not very crisp and clean. Um, as well as my shutters. I started to do the siding, but I didn't finish. But it does make a difference um, as far as making it look that much more realistic. I also used it on my steps so far. And I started on my door, just the darker edges. Um, but I haven't done any of my vertical lines yet. So upstairs on the upper level I have, I've done my vertical lines and you can see how much more crisp they are um, upstairs here too in the attic. So I hope this is helpful. Um, the other video, like I said, shows you me um, shows me using the actual ruling pen, but um, you know from like I said from this angle. So I hope this is uh, helpful that I showed you some close-ups. And uh, I'd like to see what you guys do with it. I hope it helps you out. Thanks for watching.